Hey guys, what's up? I'm Rohit Khanna, host Like Guys, and we are going to do a water test today. This is the OnePlus 7 Pro, and I've been using it for quite some time. This phone is no less than any flagship you can pit it against. But is it water resistant? OnePlus has not taken any IP rating for this phone. They have not applied for it. But the fact that this phone is very well built and has the water resistance feature built in. I have seen multiple videos by other YouTubers doing water tests. So we decided that we'll do one water test of our own in this video. So let's get started with this test. So here we have the OnePlus 7 Pro and this is in good working condition and we are going to do a water test on it now. I have started the uh, stopwatch and there is another phone to run stopwatch because when we pour water on this, uh, in every possibility the screens will uh, you know start to change and we may not be able to keep track of time on this phone. So we have a stopwatch here on another phone. So I'm going to start the stopwatch together. We are planning to keep it around five minutes underwater and see uh, how the phone functions after five minutes. We'll click up a few pictures after that and we'll uh, run a few videos. See if the screen works fine and the audio works fine after keeping it submerged five minutes underwater. So here we have uh, almost one liter of water and this is a small glass bowl around 1.5 liter in capacity. So let me start the watch first. So watch is started on both and now I'm pouring water. When the water touches the touch screen, uh, it usually uh, registers some touch and because of that the screens go bonker because it registers touch so the stopwatch uh, is not showing up here but I'm sure it is running in background and it will probably not register any touches. The phone is completely submerged in water as you can see. So let me leave it here. It has been just 35 seconds and I'm gonna leave this for around 5 minutes. I'm gonna fast forward this video so that you don't have to wait 5 minutes to watch the entire thing. So I'm just gonna fast forward some part of it. It's almost 5 minutes, around 10 seconds to go and I'm really cool and I'm not nervous about it because I have confidence that this phone shall survive because I have seen many such tests and 5 minutes are done so I'm gonna stop this timer. So I'll just keep this aside and now it is the moment of truth time to take this phone out of this bowl of water and find out whether it behaves fine, whether it survived, whether there is any water damage. I have taken out the SIM card uh, from this phone so that <laughs> there are no phone calls while I'm shooting this video. But the Wi-Fi is on, the phone is still connected to the internet, the screen is working and everything is working. So it is time to just wipe it clean once. So if your uh, phone drops in water or if you are in heavy rain and some water splashes on it, uh, the first thing to do, the most logical things to do is uh, just to wipe it clean so that uh, be it any phone, any water which is near the openings like the charging port or the speaker grills or any other openings like these uh, mic holes, you can gently wipe it and if the phone is water resistant, it would be good enough to go as you just saw. The fingerprint scanner works perfectly fine and it is time to closely inspect the cameras. So I'll first show you the front facing camera and there seems to be no water retention inside. It's fairly clean and I'm able to take a selfie. And you tell me, is this clear enough? There's no sign of uh, any water damage to the front facing camera. Now let's check out the rear facing cameras. I'll first show you the cameras closely. There's no moisture or uh, any seepage of water. The body has been sealed pretty tight. Uh, I removed the SIM card and noticed that there is a rubber seal inside. So all the openings on this phone are very nicely sealed just like any other IP rated phones are 
done but this one is not officially rated but it has water resistance built in so the camera lenses are fine let's uh, click a few pictures with the rear facing cameras and show you so this is the normal 1x mode this is the 3x mode and this is the wide mode and let me show you all three photos so that you can have an idea whether the lenses are clean or affected by this water and to me all these three photos appear very clean very detailed very sharp the phone is not at all affected by the water the touch response on this phone is absolutely perfect there's no problem as you can see it is responding fairly well and uh, i'm not seeing any issues when it comes to touch there is no issue when it comes to taking pictures now let's play a video on youtube and find out how the speakers are faring are uh, they affected so let me just pull out a video from our channel hey guys what's up i'm rohit kumar host and click digest and we have with us the jbl go bluetooth wireless speakers from jbl and in this video i'm going to unbox this show you so in my honest opinion i don't see any degradation in terms of speaker volume as well the dual stereo speakers on the OnePlus 7 Pro one here on top and one here on bottom and they both but all it gets but all it comes with i also give you a demo they are both sounding as normal as they were before uh, submerging this phone for 5 minutes under water so if you buy a OnePlus 7 Pro you will have that peace of mind if you accidentally even uh, get it in heavy rain or drop it in a shallow swimming pool this phone is going to be fine as soon as uh, you realize that you have dropped your phone in water or it has gotten wet just wipe it clean with a dry cloth and you are good to go need not worry need not panic and you have not lost your phone it is good and uh, that stopwatch that we started in the beginning of the video is still running so yes the application wasn't closed it just went to the background and the phone works perfectly fine it is perfectly water resistant although oneplus does not officially claim it but i can vouch for it that it is probably never going to be damaged with even the heaviest splash of water this is all we have on this video and this phone did survive the water test what are your views about this test do let us know in the comments section stay subscribed for more give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching this video stay subscribed for more this is your host rohit kurana signing off thanks for watching